Good morning. We are looking at Acts 3 verses 7 through 10. So we're in another section of uh, Acts 3. He took him by the right hand and lifted him up and immediately he his feet and ankle bones received strength. Notice they gave man uh, a hand up, not a hand out. Perhaps the only medical uh, men can fully appreciate the meaning of these words. They're peculiar uh, technical words of a medical person. The word translated feet uh, is used only by Luke. It doesn't occur elsewhere. Remember, Luke's a doctor. It indicates his discrimination between different parts of the human heel. Uh, and the phrase ankle bones is, again, a medical phrase and found nowhere else. Uh, and it's exciting to see the personality of Luke coming out as a doctor. So he, leaping up, stood and walked and entered the temple with them, walking and leaping and praising God. The word leaping uh, describes uh, the coming suddenly uh, into a socket, something that was not there. His joints worked. Uh, this then is a very careful medical description of what happened in connection with this man. As soon as he was healed, uh, this former lame man had three uh, good things. First, he attached himself to the apostles. He entered the temple with them. Secondly, uh, he immediately started to use what God had given him, walking and leaping. Uh, have we just been sitting? We need to be walking. We need to be leaping. And finally, he gave praise to God and worship in worship. And so uh, the people, it says, on all the people saw him walking and praising God, and they knew that this was he who sat begging alms at the beautiful gate of the temple. They were filled with wonder because of what happened and amazement uh, for what had happened to the man. This man was more than 40 years old, Acts 4, 22. He had been crippled since birth. He was, he was a familiar sight at the temple gate. Therefore, Jesus must have passed by without healing him. And I wonder if he was saving it for this particular time so that the church could grow. Wonder and amazement, an important part of being a, Chris, a Christian. Are we dead? Are we sitting? Uh, or do we experience wonder?